hundred four. Sorry. Come on. This is a pre-recorded message from South by Southwest. Now, as you all know, there is nothing more synergy-inducing and cool than corporations and music coming together. It was a huge success this past... It was a huge... Damn it! You morons! Just open that damn door! The merger of science and food has always inspired me. It's what makes Star Cream the world's largest coffee and donut company. Now, as everyone knows, every year we issue a new flavor from pumpkin fizz to green tea mocha donut. And today, today I am proud to announce our newest flavor to the family. Cinelicious, Zoe Walker cinnamon bun flavored mocha chino. such an honor. I, I never dreamed this could be possible. But, but after long hours in the lab and extensive market analysis, I can confidently say that this is statistically guaranteed to be our most popular flavor ever. <laughs> okay, creamers, back to creating. Mr. Crofts, thank you. Thank so much. I learned many things at that music festival, like how Millennials care about the story behind their food, the farm where their kale is grown, the Portland Collective where their bullshit chai sea jam was made. You see what I'm saying? Oh, well, uh, I, I guess the story for Cinelicious is that it was made in a lab and based on a focus group. Exactly, which is why it will fail. Look, I know things have been difficult since Carl left. God, he was brilliant. That's stealing. But since last year's carrot cake latte debacle, go back to work. Back to work. Star Cream will not survive another flop. Don't worry, sir. Cinelicious is bound to hit every demographic. Not with freeze dried coffee crystals. No, 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 no. We're gonna use real beans from a real farm. Something, something natural. Something hand picked. But, but isn't that more expensive? I want you to scout the warehouses in Medellin. I want you to find a company that believes in this product. Something, something interesting. Something real. Something. Look at me. Something with a story behind it. Yeah. Sorry. You want to send me to Colombia? You impressed me with this one, and you could run your own lab. I must ride now. <laughs> Wish I could just take my lab coat. <sighs> Why not? My turn now, asshole. My family has been in Colombia since the good old days. And I can personally assure Star Cream the largest quantities for the lowest prices. Thank you, but is there a, a story behind this place or the beans? Well, you're not just looking at Colombian beans. Our company is more of a loading dock. We carry beans from all over. Peru, Brazil, Venezuela. Peru. 
There's a lot of environmental damage in those countries. <laughs> this is how we can keep up with the demand of companies such as Star Cream. Everyone wins. Your test samples is requested. Thank you. What is... is that mold? I can assure you, our beans carry the same flavor as any generic grocery store brand. We took the liberty of brewing you some coffee. Thank you. Enjoy. Aromatic quality. Medicinal. Oh. What is that smell? Must be the smell of our wonderful coffee. No, it's it's coming from outside. Thank you. We will be in touch. Hang on, you haven't even tasted it. I don't need to. you for to red? Sure. An old Turkish tradition. I thought we're in Colombia. Coffee, my dear, is everywhere. Only drink from one side of the cup. That is incredible. No, it's, it's transcendent. Make a wish. My own lab. Oh, my. You are going to go in a long, long journey. Let me guess. Back to America? wish will come true. If you tell me where to get these beans, my wish really will come true. Okay, but it's my story. Perfect. Deep in the jungle, where the hummingbirds sing and the jaguars sleep, is a place. Only here will you find these treasure beans. Many have gone, seeking the black gold for themselves. But all have been turned away. We are still talking about coffee, are we? Yes, the best coffee. Organic, all natural. Straight from farm to cup. From farm to cup? Cubs will love that. By the farm is in trouble. It's been played by the head. If fortune lost love. I can help. Uh, my company can help. Great coffee and a great story. But who? What? Where? Cafetal La Cabra Bailarina. The Dancing Gold Coffee Plantation. In the heart of San Vicente. San Vicente. You will find Diego Valdez. Diego Valdez. Bravo, bravo.
message to the G to the O to the double B is. Hi, sir. Zoe Walker. Um, I've had to extend my trip a little longer, but... Of course. Sí, San Vicente. Anybody here? Anybody? You, um, hey, excuse me. Do you speak English? Um, habla inglés. Sí. Forgot how everything close our island this town. Oh, it's my first time here. Uh, do you know where the dancing goat is? It's a coffee plantation. They make the best coffee I have ever tasted. I'm a coffee buyer from Star Cream. Star Cream? Yeah. You're not gonna like this, but it's um, all the way up there. Mm. No, you've gotta be kidding me. Up there? Mm-hmm. And first you have to cross the river. River? Piranhas at the moment. <laughs> um, but excuse me, is the bridge safe? Eh, más o menos. So so. Come on. <laughs> oh wow! It's moving. It's a bridge. my own lab. I'm gonna design water. 
What that has already been invented. And when I get my own lab, it's going to be air conditioned. The dancing goat. We're here. The dancing goat. Yes. And thank you. Let's buy some beans. Hello? Hola? Anybody here? in town. Oh, hi. I just got here. Okay. Well, you can stay the night in the barn. But the last man Digo tried to steal our donkey, so please don't get any ideas. Believe me, I don't want to see a donkey. But hey, I'm not homeless. No, I've come to talk to Diego Valdez. Oh, sure. And uh, what do you want with Diego Valdez? Sorry, I don't normally look like this, or, oh, I don't smell like this either. I'm Zoe Walker. I'm a coffee buyer from Star Cream. Amatia! Tia Juanita! Y you? How did you get here before? I left before you. I took a plane. You said I had to go on a long journey. Your fortune said a long journey. Tia, how could you bring this American Phyllis tale hey. to my plantation? Don't be so rude, Diego. Hey, you're Diego Valdez? Yeah, yeah. And let me guess. My aunt fed you an El Dorado tale about some magical plantation? Yeah, normally, I would think it was a scam. But I tasted your coffee. And it is the real deal. So, so I came. I would rather burn this entire plantation to the ground than ever so to you. My nephew can be a little dramatic. Oh, my God, what have I done? Remember, your wish will come true. Which way to the barn? I can offer you a room much better than the barn. I really appreciate you letting me stay here. I'm sorry about Diego. He has trouble with change. But you know, always don't open new doors. Oh, is this Diego and his little sister? Well, I suppose they do look alike, but that's Olivia. She grew up on the next farm. Olivia was Diego's fiance, but that's all in the past. I'm sorry. Things happen. Listen, I really do want to share your coffee with the world, but Diego seems pretty adamant. Maybe I came on too strong. I definitely wasn't my most professional. Tomorrow is a new day. I let you settle in. Maybe take a shower? Oh, definitely. Thank you. Welcome. Star cream. <laughs> More like star crap. All the monstrosities they come up with. Hey, how about a hot dog latte? Wow, it sounds delicious, right? O or a waffle macchiato? Jesus, why not just serve flavored mug? Oh, Tia. Please, 
that nice girl came all the way here to buy from you, and you turned her away? Please. Nice girl. Tia, who knows what junk she wants to turn my beans into. Junk. The only junk I hear are the words coming out of your mouth. I'm very disappointed with you, Diego. You are a wonderful farmer, but a pessimo empresario. You know, you're always raving how people nowadays don't understand the beauty of coffee. This is your chance. Show her. This is our last year, Diego. I know that. You know that. But it doesn't have to be. If you make this deal, this girl, Zoe, is here. And she can help us. Yeah? And we see Turu. you've come to send me to the barn. Uh, no. <laughs> I thought you might be hungry. Um, this is Sancocho de Gallina. Chicken soup with root vegetables. My aunt's specialty. Well, thank you. Sure. And uh, I also wanted to make a deal. Look, you caught me at a very difficult time. I will sell my beans to Star Cream, but they're not to be used in any asqueroso flavors. They must be sold as is. You know, not all flavors are bad. I mean, if we only knew vanilla, we wouldn't know the joys of chocolate or, or Rocky Road. And I, for one, would not want to live in a world hey, without hey, Rocky hey, Road. Hey, hey. Hey, my family didn't toil under the Columbian sun for six generations to make a rocky road. They did it to make coffee, pure and adulterated coffee. And that's the only way I will sell it. Okay, fine. Look, we really value your beans, and Star Cream would be honored to be a part of that. No flavors. Star Cream would be honored because the star cream really values my beans. Mm hmm values, appreciates, adores. We can have the trucks here by tomorrow. We haven't finished the final harvest, and roasting takes time. Oh, no, don't worry about it. We'll do the roasting ourselves. Roasting is the most important part. Oh. Tell you what. You can prove how much a star cream appreciates, values, adores my beans by doing the final harvest with me. I must know my beans are in the hands of someone who understands that coffee is not just a simple beverage, but an invitation to life. Hmm? <sighs> you will work from dawn to dusk. You will pour your sweat and blood into the soil. Blood? You will fall in love with my beans. Okay, and how long does bean love take? Oh, a lifetime but realistically, a few days. So, you may bring your trucks once you have made the perfect roast. I will think about it. Fine, think about it. But if you're in, we start tomorrow, 6 a.m. a deal. I will make the perfect roast. Or die trying. 
looks amazing. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my goodness. Mm. I'm I'm detecting banana, strawberry, and mango. It has a high pulp concentration and yet a sherbet-like texture. Do you always talk like that? What is this most delectable fruit? Chirimoya. Yeah. Yeah, it's called Chirimoya. Mark Twain. No, no, let me, let me. Mark Twain call it the most delicious fruit known to man. But you know, I think it's the most delicious fruit known to donkeys. I introduce myself. My name is Jorge. But everybody here calls me Catula. And this, this is pea berry. Hi, I'm Zoe. Sorry? Zoe. Zombie? What's that, a name? No, no, we're going to do something. You call me Caturra, and I'll call you Pelo Loco, okay? Okay, yeah. that sounds pretty. Yeah. That means crazy hair. Oh. <laughs> He's very cute. No, no, Peaberry. Peaberry's a woman. Oh, I am so sorry. How would you like some cherimoya, Peaberry? Oh, come on. That's it. Oh, oh she shit. loves it. Yeah, she loves it. <laughs> Good girl. I think that's enough. Eat it. First, you need to stand on soil and feel the plant's energy. Okay, ready. Good. You will pick the entire row. Only the red cherries. And tomorrow, you will pick the whole row again. What? Why? The I'm... orange cherries will be ripe tomorrow. I'm sorry, but this is not an instant blend. Quality takes time. It sure does. Hey, you're the girl from town. And you're the coffee buyer. She spent the night, I see. Here comes trouble. ¿Y tú te sigues comiendo esa mula? Don't call her mula. What are you doing here, Olivia? I just got back. I thought that we could talk. Well, uh, I'm busy. I'm busy right now with my new worker, and we were just about to start picking. I should go uh, make a phone call. You guys should talk. Show me where the phone is. I'm sure I can find it by myself. Are you okay? She thinks she can just show up after years oh, of what? Who's this little fatty? What, what? Oh, that's uh, Jorge. No way. Gosh, you guys have known each other for quite some time then, huh? My parents cared for him. Oh, they cared for his pet as well. That's Peaberry. Oh, wow. Your parents sound incredible. They were. Okay, uh, make it quick. We've got a lot of work to do. Hey, Diego? Yeah. I hope my presence doesn't complicate anything between you and Olivia. Oh, it's already pretty complicated. fall from this century? That would be great. My room. Oh. <laughs> what can I say? Diego's parents really love coffee. I gather they're not around anymore. Yes, they passed away years ago. Diego and I are the only Valdez left. I'm so sorry. Oh, the memories still live on in our hearts. Oh, your phone! Oh, wow. Or, or do you prefer my computer? Diego? Diego, come on, don't avoid me. I don't hear from you for years. 
and then you just suddenly show up? I'm sorry. It was wrong of me the way I disappeared. I don't know what happened to you in London, but you cannot just come back here and expect everything to be the same. I've moved on. It's a uh, her, the cafe buyer. Her name is Zoe, and she's not just helping me with the harvest, but she's going to share my coffee with the world. Whoa, Mr. Gobbs? What do you think? It's called Moroccan Boy. It's a hot tan shade this year. I was not aware of that. Where you been, yo? Star Kermit's need to stay in star communication. I know, I'm sorry. I'm in the middle of nowhere. But I have exactly what we're looking for. We have a great story. The plantation is natural, organic, and legendary. It produces the highest grade quality coffee farm to cup. Holy shiza, that's brilliant! How much have you shipped? Oh, well, they're very eco-conscious. They want to make sure the people buying their coffee really appreciate it. We'll ship as soon as I finish helping with the harvest. Ingenious approach, Zoe. Zoe, Zoe, you are brilliant! Thank you, sir. Everyone is going to want some delicious now. This is going to be our, our, our El Dorado. About that, sir? You're not worried about that lab, are you? How did you know? I haven't forgotten. You just make sure nothing derails in delicious. I want those beans ASAP. Gobs out. Sir. Sir. The... <sighs> okay. Let's do this. Man, it's going to take forever. I'm really loving the land. Totally appreciating nature. Nina, Nina, Nina. It's all in the wrist. Check it out. My wrist technique is legendary. <laughs> I think that it is. Do you want me to teach you? It's very easy. Here, look. You grab a bunch of beans, you twist, you push down with your thumb, you see? And that's it. I guess I could use some help. Yeah. Cool. Here, um, try that branch right there. Oh, cute. Look at the little frog. Oh. I think he likes you. <laughs> <laughs> no! Jeez, what? God, that thing was like the size of my pinky toe. Don't worry. That thing carries enough poison on its skin to kill ten men. What? How could you not have told me that was poisonous? I could have died. I, uh, guess I forgot. Forgot? That was crazy, Olivia. Just do it. You like it. El ahorrito! El ahorrito! Ele! Why did you do that? Be very! Come on, be ready. No, 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 no. Be ready. Come on, come here. I am so sorry, Jorge. I love my best friend forever. Okay, that's enough. You, no more picking. And you, mm -hmm. what are you even doing here? Take that basket off. Why? I'm just doing what I'm good at. Uh. Okay, if I'm not picking, can I be roasting? You will now learn to pulverize. Come, follow me. Thanks for nothing. Oh! Is this where you murder me? What? Here is where I show you the despulpadora. You know, I feel really bad about Peaberry. And what is wrong with Olivia? Donkeys are bred to be with men, she'll return. And as for Olivia, we have some issues. I would like to apologize for what happened there. You know what? Don't worry about it. Let's just get through this. What did you call this again? The Dora the Explorer? <laughs> the Despulpadora. 
Okay. Excuse me. Other farms use a mechanical one, but this is more selective. You can actually see which beans have been diskinned and which haven't, okay? Watch it. Oh, and it's a better workout than CrossFit. Great. Oh, hey, when am I gonna be able to roast? When you're ready. All yours. Really? A dart frog? <sighs> that was crazy, Olivia. I don't trust her, Diego. Trust? Oh, come on. You tried to kill her. Oh, come on. Don't exaggerate. <sighs> Plus, I'm sure that Tia Juanita has some medicine. Besides, it's a natural selection. <laughs> You know I'm serious. There's something up. What's going on between you and her? Hmm? How could you, Diego, from the great Valdez family, sell to a company like Starcream? I know you, and I know that you prefer to burn this whole plantation to the ground. Well, maybe you don't know me anymore. Where are you going? At least give me a ride. What happened to your motorbike? I don't ride anymore. That's not surprising. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Well, let me remind you that you always hated having fun. And things never change. Well, our priorities were always different. Looks like your parents got new gates. Will you like to stop in? I'm sure that my parents would love to see you. Maybe some other time. Sure. Bye. Hey, wait. It's good to see you. Part of me is sore. Oh, I can't feel my limbs. If only I can feel my heart. Oh. Think I would be waiting in un santiamen. I I don't understand. In a jeepy. Oh, okay, please. I'm just gonna sit here for a while and just relax. Diego, I don't want you to lose focus. When the lead is around, you don't think straight. And why are you being so hard on Zoe? Putting her to work in the fields? She doesn't know the land or where it's dangerous. I'm teaching her to appreciate coffee and protecting our legacy. But maybe I don't have to sell to Star Cream. Maybe Olivia's return is for a reason. Please, Diego, open your eyes. You don't need Olivia that way. Tia, how do I know if I can trust Zoe? I know Olivia. Then you should know not to trust her. Okay, do you think a Mayapa who dedicated their life to this place would want to get involved with a 
glorified fast food chain. I think Su Papa and Su Mama would want you to be your own man. Dinner will be ready soon. The dinner is ready. I have a cherimoya. Peaberry? Peaberry? No, it's I. Sadly, it's only I. Guess you were looking for her too, huh? Yeah. I'm gonna tell you something that maybe it could sound a little bit crazy, but even when I was with her, I miss her. Hey, I'm really sorry about Peaberry. No, 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 it's not your fault. It's Olivia. She upsets everything. What was I thinking, coming here and farming? I guess I was just so... Desperate? Driven. I was going to say driven. Uh. Yeah, you're right. I guess it was desperate. <laughs> I swore I would have my own lab someday. I just wanted to prove it. Prove it to who? To yourself or to someone else? I don't know why I let my ex get to me. He's a liar. He stole everything. I know what it feels to have your heart stolen. Oh, no, no, no. He stole my idea. Ah, ideas. Ah, no, no, no. Don't worry. You'll have more. Okay. Uh, but lately, lately I've just been stuck. Look, you work hard. And with your heart, that's something that Olivia never did. So come on, Pelo Loco. You're smart, so use that. Sorry, so we. Yes. Hey, <laughs> what's all this? Now we don't have to waste time lugging them downhill. Okay. What do you think? <laughs> Not bad. By the way, do you have any more rope? Yeah, sure. Show me. <laughs> Check this out. What are you doing? Wait for it. Hey, be careful. This ladder is hold. Just a little bit more. Okay. Okay. Here. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Nice catch. Oh, my pleasure. Okay. 
not bad, huh? It doesn't use any more energy. It's still using your grandfather's device. And it allows for the worker to clean up a little bit. Let's go. Good. So we have pick, pulverize, wash, and now rake. Rake? No, when am I going to be able to roast? Hey, in time, I promise. I liked it better in the murder shed with the fan. <laughs> Some plantations use a mechanical dryer, but there is nothing better than the beautiful climbing sun. Right? Okay. Here, you try. Thank you. Yeah. Start raking. Oh, man. No wonder you're so ripped. I mean, from an observational standpoint, your biceps are in peak condition. Okay, uh, just, uh, continue raking while. Wait a minute. Excuse me. That's gotta be faster. How? Do you do that? What? That. Think like that. Well, uh, I guess I've always enjoyed problem solving, being creative. I just, I haven't had a big idea in a long time. What was your last big idea? Well, I... I invented the glow nut. The what? It's a colorful croissant donut. Okay. Well, that actually sounds pretty good. Yeah. Everybody loves it. You know what? I think you're ready to roast. Finally. Yes. <laughs> oh, it is so nice and cool in here. Not for long. You can't possibly roast all those beans on this tiny thing. Oh, no, actually, Whoa. we usually use the machine. But my father learned how to make the perfect roast over a fire. And his father before that. Before he passed away, we used to stand here side by side together. And he taught me to make the perfect roast. I'm going to try my best. Good. So, put in only a smidgen of beans, okay? A smidgen? Compared to a sack, it's like three dollops. Stir the beans until you hear a pop, 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 just like popcorn, which also came from Colombia. No way. Yeah. Hey, by the way, maybe Star Cream wants to make a popcorn cappuccino. Wow. Come on. What? No, no I'm, I'm serious. No, you are not. E of course I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I guess Olivia's not around today, huh? I don't know. You must have missed her. Well, um, her absence caused a lot of problems. We were going to merge our two farms together. <clears throat> uh, okay, so you keep steering until the beans turn the color of soil after it rains, okay? The color of soil after it rains? What, what does that even... Hey, where are you going? To bring you more beans.
<laughs> How are you? It's Diego home. Do you know my tia me? You broke that boy's heart, and they had to put it back together. I'm here to make amends. I don't know where he is. You do not know where he is. Um, do you mind if I step inside? Yes. Tiny little frogs again? No, I came to apologize. Oh. Here. Wet wipes? No, thank you. I'm fine. I had some great times in this place. We used to get so hot. The trick is to take the pan off as soon as you hear the cook. I know. Of course. You're a scientist. That's right. I am. What is it that you do? Do you cure cancer? Or do you design space shuttles? Or flavors? I design flavors. Mm -hmm. Look, I really appreciate you taking time out of your obviously hectic schedule to come teach me how to fry beans. Roast. <laughs> You're roasting. Yeah, Learn in a something. frying pan. You know, those are my beans that you're handling. Really? Because, you see, I'm pretty sure they're Diego's beans. And I have been handling Diego's beans all day. Whoops. Oh, my God. I should go. What is wrong with you? Come help me put this out. You can handle it. You're a scientist, right? <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> what the hell? No, I, hey, you know what? On second thought, I don't want to know. Because you and I, we're going out tonight. And we're going to have fun. Zoe, you ready? Yeah, sure, coming. Zoe? Yep. Wow. Hey. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, I know. Hey, you look great. Good. You look good. Good and great. Good and great. <laughs> Ready to see the real Colombia? <laughs>
Class Return! <laughs> Diego, hey, it's good to have you back. We miss you. Here. Try it. The Diego shot. Oh, yeah. Too fun. Fun. Take your first taste of Aguardiente Guaro, and I'll tell you all about it. Go ahead. <sighs> Salud. Mm. Now, <laughs> we're ready for some tejo. Any time. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Hey, come on. Oh, what in the world? Come here. I want to sh show you something. Don't forget your beers. Oh, yeah. Here. Can I have that one? Well, of course. <laughs> Thank you. Salute. Salute. Mm. Watch this out. Cover your ears. <laughs> what just happened? Huh? That was awesome. What just happened? Now you try. Okay. Okay. Give me this. Hit the metal ring, okay? You just hit. Ah. Uh, okay. Okay. You know me? I never give up. Good. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm so to do Tejo King and her queen. Yes! <laughs> that was so much fun. Yeah, right? Yes. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. You brought her to our place? Excuse me, our place? This is the only bar in town, Olivia. <laughs> Did you know she was gonna be here? What? No, no, of course not. I thought you were working so hard that you deserved a little fun, because I'm a fun guy. <laughs> Do you really want to have fun? Come on, scientists, you and me, fun guy. Let the tejo begin! Whoa! 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 No! Whoa! Whoa! Is that safe? Aww. Are you scared of a little danger? No. No way. Everyone, look at this! can dance. Okay. My mama taught me. Oh, that's so Diego, cute. Yeah. don't forget the tradition. It's gonna be nice. <laughs> I thought you would hate harvesting, but you really put your heart into it. Well, you know, I'm actually happy you're making me do it. You work in the lab so long, you forget where food even comes from. I was kind of hoping that this experience would help me find a new idea, though. Hmm, like the glow nut. Exactly. <laughs> I was engaged, too. But he stole my idea and started a whole glow nut empire without me. I've seen you worried, Zoe. The next big idea will come. Hey, i never seen a scientist work so hard at farming. <laughs> 
You know, at first I just wanted to get the hell out of there. But I really appreciate everything you've been showing me. I think we're making some really good coffee together. But honestly, do you think Americans will like the flavor? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they'll like the flavors. Mm. Hey, let's get out of here. Come on. Me la llevo. Dale, pues. Bye. Gracias. Okay, from here, we walk. It's not too far. You lead the way. Sure. It's really nice to see you so relaxed. I was just thinking the same about you. Careful. <laughs> days here, and I don't want to complicate anything for you. But Come here. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my, my God. God. That's one way to close a deal. What the hell are you doing here, Olivia? I won tonight, so I'm here to claim my prize. I should, um, I should go? No, 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 no. If anyone should go, it's her. Get out of my bed right now. Diego, Diego, please. Calm down. I miss you. And uh, I understand now that we belong together. For years, you were all I could think of. But you cheated and left. Now, I need to be with someone who I can trust. I thought that we could talk. Yeah, talk. Well, it's, it's late and it's very dark outside, so maybe you can give me a ride home. You, you can have the other guest room. Okay, fine. I will sleep here. Hey, I'm sorry about that. No, I'm sorry. No, 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 you have nothing to be sorry about. Mom, it is getting late. Zoe, I had really fun tonight. Me too. Like my hangover is having a hangover. Se levantó la gringa. I got up some of your favorite fruit this morning. Thank you. Um, I don't think I'm ready to eat just yet. Uh, can I please use your computer again? Of course, of course. What's up, ladies? Sir, I have to talk to you. Eat this, yo. Sin delicious. The taste be so vicious. Grab a cup, dunk it down. It's so hashtag delicious. Hashtag delicious. For the drink, yo. You believe no one's used it yet? 
Sir, we can't. You see scenes for some malicious. Sorry, what? The coffee farmer who runs this place. He's only selling to us because he thinks we're selling these beans as is. Now, these are hand-picked, hand-split, hand-dried, even hand-roasted beans, sir. They're perfect. And he didn't want to see such high quality be bulldozed over by one of our test tube flavors. No, but this is the flavor, you know? It's, it, this is the flavor of the year. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, sir, but... I have to agree with him. We can't use these beans for Sinalicious. I do want to use them for something else, though. And I'll go back to Medellin and find some other beans we can use, but not these. Absolutely not. We launched next week. We're, we're already running commercials for these beans. Oh, no, no. What have I done? What if I don't get these beans for some malicious? Then you're fired. Zoe, hey, I, I have to tell you something. something. You first. Okay. Um, I wanted to apologize again what happened last night, and say that I'm going to miss you. I don't know what the future holds. I know we'll be far apart. But whatever happens, I'm glad to have met you. And I really hope we can work something out. I really hope we can work something out, too. Really, really hoping. Hey, so what is it you wanted to tell me? I am going to make the perfect roast today. I tell him, I tell him not. I tell him, I tell him not. Wait, perfect. After it rains, the color of soil. After it rains. Diego! <gasps> Diego! 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 Jorge? You know that? I know someone who is going to be very, very excited to see you. Katuda! Jorge! <laughs> oh, yeah. Where is it? Oh, Pepe. Oh, my baby. I miss you so much. Oh, I miss your hips. Look at this. My baby. What's all this? I finally made the perfect roast. You? Let me see. Oh. Oh, perfect. 
Congratulations. Thank you. You know who is going to be very proud? Diego. Yeah. Do you know where he is? Uh, I think. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Diego! Diego! Diego, I... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I knew she couldn't be trusted. So, this is what my beans are destined for. How could you lie to me? I am so sorry. I lied to you. But I was going to tell you the truth. You're right. Using your beans in Sinalicious would be a travesty. But I think you should do it anyway. What? It'll save the farm. Hopefully, I can talk them into selling the beans as is. Or maybe you can find another buyer. But if not, the dancing goat will still be yours. No, you don't want that warehouse full of beans to go to waste. But they're going to waste right now. Using them in Sinalicious is actually its a good thing. Just sorry you had to find out this way. I was going to tell you. Say something. Please, Diego, anything. I don't need a start cream to save this place. We're getting married. The engagement is back on. We're going to marriage our two farms, as we always intended. Diego. You should go. I already call you a taxi. Hi, Mr. Cobbs. I can't believe you still have a landline. Uh, um, sir, I didn't get the deal. I know. Uh, I'm so, so sorry. This isn't some small oops. We had to push the launch of Sinalicious to source another vendor. Our entire advertising campaign had to be scrapped. You're fired. Make sure you turn in your badge.
Diego, Juanita, look. Pibere's not eating. What's happened? I don't know what's going on. Pibere. Oh, hi. She's not eating? I think she's pregnant. Oh. What? She's pregnant. Oh, beauty. Oh, my baby. Who did this to you? Mm. Come on, come on. Let's go. Oh, my God, she's pregnant. Ew, that ass is back. Stay away. I'm staying away. Diego, change that face. I'm sorry she hurt you like that. Yeah, me too. Now we just have to look to the future. You know, why don't we go to my parents' house to see the farm? I'm sure they're gonna love to see you. <laughs> Maybe I'll get a cat. No. Skins. Yes. So, do you like it? Well, uh, your parents have made a lot of changes. Let the tour continue. Look, now what we do is we just drop the beans into these dryers and that's it. Now we have time to do other stuff. Other stuff? Yeah. What other stuff? Anything that we want. We're not tied to this place anymore. Perfect roast. I've been thinking. Mm -hmm. And? And I think we are rushing this. Why are you saying that? Olivia, we cannot just pick up where we left off. Of course we can. We will make it work. The designer you left me for, he dumped you. Let's just say that his preferred blend was light and fruit. OK. Well, I don't want to be anyone's second choice. So that's it? What about the wedding? What's gonna happen with the farm? I've decided to sell to Star Cream. For Cinelicious? You're not gonna be able to sleep at night. They can use the beans for whatever they want. I don't care. I can always go more. So you're finally sacrificing the famous Valdez pride for money? You will never understand.
Oh my gosh. Yes. Dad Jon Snow, qué papacito eres. Oh. Yeah. Get Siri on your phone. I need you lad pad to scan myself a plane ticket. What? Not the way you said was correct. Yeah. As you say, people make mistakes. Mine was to let Zoe go. Okay, so. Hmm, that button? This one. No, the other one. Yeah. Yeah. By the way, where's Olivia? Uh. The warehouse is on fire! Come on! What? You cannot tell to start cream after all. Olivia, what have you done? Nothing. Nothing. I'm, I'm very sad about it. I want to help however I can. Um, you know, uh, I, I still think that, that, that I can save the farm. Do you remember what you gave me? Of course, I remember. Well, you can give it to your soul wife, Angel! Remember? I've come up with a million dollar idea. Make that a multi million dollar idea. Multi million. It's okay. I. I'm listening. Taste this. Oh no. Last time a fired employee gave me a drink, I had dysentery for weeks. No thank you. Lesson learned. Believe me, if I wanted to poison you, I wouldn't have shown up in person. So here, look. All right, give me. <sighs> Effervescent. Fruity. Complex. Invigorating. This is the best artisanal soda I have ever tasted. No, it's not just an artisanal soda. It's an artisanal energy drink. Wait a minute, so you added caffeine? No, nope. it's all natural. It's made from coffee cherries. Look at this. Turns out there's actually more caffeine in the skin than there is the bean. It is 100% organic. That's brilliant. Forget about turning in your badge. I will have your new lab ready in no time. I think this recipe is worth a lot more than a new lab. And the next flight to Medellin? Perfect. <laughs> you plane ticket. Okay. So it's only a flight per day, so don't miss it. It lands at 2, and then it leaves at 3 to Medellin. Okay. I'm very proud of you, Diego. And I know su papa y su mamá también. Go find her.
I missed it. Missed what? What? I cannot believe you're here. I was about to fly and find you. You were? I ended it with Olivia. I want to be with you. I came to win you back. I told Olivia how I feel about you. She burned down the warehouse. Oh, my God. Yeah. I was going to sell to start you. I didn't want you to lose your job. But now, I have to sell the dancing goat. No. No, no, what if I could... What if I could pay you double for your next harvest? In advance. Please. No jokes right now. I am serious. Now, you sell us the coffee beans and the cherry skins. We're going into production on the world's first ever artisanal energy drink. I named it Peaberry Secret. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Thank you. 